starting live video sweet. Cool. Hey everybody, welcome to Rank You Very Much. Oh my gosh, it's the podcast you've been waiting for your entire life, I think. This episode 52, I'm your host Joe Bates. We're going to be talking about the best bottled water, folks. That's water that comes in a bottle, in case you don't understand. Uh, it's going to be a fantastic episode. And as always, to help me figure out what the best bottled water is, we have two special guest experts. To the left of me is a man who, for his living, sells wells. I sell wells. Jeff Stanich. Uh, I gotta ask you, Jeff. Mm. Go ahead. As a well salesman. Yeah. Or a sale wellsman. Sale wellsman. Are you concerned about the bottled water industry mm -hmm. destroying uh, what you've built your entire life around? I spend most of my waking hours concerned about bottled waters. What about your sleeping hours? Uh... Those are nightmares. They come and go. <laughs> they come and go. Uh, I can't get away from them. Uh, not only are they destroying the planet, they're destroying my business, more importantly. And uh, So you, you're yeah. concerned that the plastic on the bottle of water is destroying the planet? Well, that's, you know, common uh, speak. But I mean. what you do is drill holes into the planet. Right. To take away the nutrients inside the planet and drain it out. Right. Okay. Um, but I... Grew up Christian, so I feel like it's my right to just <laughs> that's fine just dig into the earth. I would, I'm not. The, it, hey, there's one thing Ranky very much does not disagree with. It's the stance of a Christian. You can take that to the bank. Ranky very much doesn't support most statements that I say on the show. Just so you know, the podcast and me have different views. Mm. Uh, and to the right of me, folks, this this shy son of a gun. Uh, he is. Uh, you may know him. He's been in. He's been in a lot of the food and water magazines. He is a water sommelier, Connor Roberts. In training, in training. Uh, oh. uh, <laughs> uh yeah, Jeff. saying he is in training. <laughs> I'm just saying he's not there yet. I'm very close though, so <laughs> if you could just. Uh... There are like 400 people that are very close in your class. I though, get... So as a water sommelier in your uh, your community college class that you're taking, um, can you tell how old the water is? No, that'd be dumb, Joe. We taste water, we see how it tastes, and we tell you. Just how it tastes. Just how it tastes. So my I, my bad, a wine sommelier, they can tell you the year, what type of barrel the wood was made of. But a water smelly is not that detailed. It's basically you take a sip of water and you say, what? "Well, well, uh, well, jo Joey." Keep, well, that's I would, keep my business out of your mouth. There's no copyright in that word, is there? Well, it depends how he says it. Okay, <laughs> Joey. Uh, All Joe, right. Is that is that okay? I prefer Joe, possibly. Okay, okay Joe. Uh, <laughs> be a dick. It, I, Do you guys know each other? Yeah, sure. We, we <laughs> ask him. Who, ask him who pays for his community college. Uh, who <laughs> has, who pays for your community college? My grandmother does. Uh, my, my grandparents are all dead. All four of them. Oh, you mentioned that. Well, not on the podcast. I feel like it needs to be said. Uh, unfortunately, hmm. we rode here together. Oh, I see. So he was your Uber driver. Okay, I um. Want to ask you though? So, as a water sommelier, before you're rudely interrupted by a well salesman, yeah. <laughs> what 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 do you then? What do you produce as a water sommelier? Like, what is your when you're describing how a nice uh, taste of fine H two O? It's a great question. Washes around your mouth. What could you describe in your some say poetic, some say eloquent uh, way of describing water? So what I like to do as a water sommelier is go to a nice uh, cliff, Clifty Falls, Indiana, has some nice cliffs. Yeah, well that's what it's named after, and uh, some falls. And my mother will uh, drive me there, and then I'll have her take a picture of me drinking uh, different types of water. Yeah. And then I post that picture to uh, social media, to my blogs. Okay. And I... just the picture, not any no words of describing it. Just you sipping. Oh the no, water. there's words. There's. Oh words. okay. Uh, I, for a second there, I thought your was Molly was just showing you drinking different no, water. No. Uh, Cliffy Falls. And I'll say, you know, I like it. I Cliffs don't like it. it. Um, yeah. And uh, are you? Do you usually like it? No, I'm not a water person. Yeah, just a Somali 
Hey, uh, okay, well that's fine. I've learned two things. One, um, I mean, if you find a water that you like, that's probably a good water. And two, you never drive yourself anywhere. Uh, no, yourself no. Here. Then drive yourself here. You know, uh, water sommeliers are notoriously dehydrated because they just sip and spit. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I stay hydrated. Your, your pee's <laughs> yellow. It, it's a common negative stereotype of water sommeliers that they're like dehydrated. Like apple juice, like your pee. in the bathroom once because I'm so <laughs> conscious. You said you weren't going to... All right, guys, we're going to start today's episode uh, with, again, as always, the first round of veto, and we go with the list. Oh, I didn't even mention the list. I got so caught up in this... <laughs> This debate that's had... I never had a debate like this had before. Sorry, but our list sorry. behind... No, no worries. It's only your fault. Uh, there's no... Uh, the list behind me, the water, bottle water we talk about, is Evian, Dasani, Aquafina, Raw Water, Vulvic, Smart Water, uh, Fiji, Ice Mountain, LaCroix, Perrier, and Arrowhead. Uh, so that's... Those are all different bottled waters. <laughs> and so we're going to talk about which one's the best... And when you go out and buy it at the store afterwards. So, folks, uh, as always, we start with the oldest person here, Connor Roberts. Could you please uh, let us know what you think? <laughs> Your, what, what bottle of water on here is not the best? What should be taken off the list? Uh, I think it's pretty obvious we get rid of Perrier. Wow! So, you're, so for you, as a water sommelier... I would assume, because you have a French name in your name, you would love Perrier, which is also French. Um, actually, I just don't like the French. I, <laughs> you don't like the French at all? Uh, no. Um, and here's, uh, there, uh, Joey, jo Joe. I would prefer Joe, I can't, there's, I can't stress that. There's enough. a very important reason why, um. You're racist. Trump's gonna build a wall, it's gonna Towards be. Towards the French. Okay, so racism, Trump builds a wall. These are two separate things, I think. Uh, <laughs> Very separate. I, I. So Trump, you think Trump's gonna build a wall between us and France? Is that what you think? It's gonna be a great mall. Um, well, we already have a great mall. It's the Mall well, of America. Uh, Trump is a businessman. I think he's gonna put a great mall inside of. Uh, the wall. The great wall. Uh, There's a mall inside the wall, or a wall inside the mall. Ooh. There is a mall inside the wall. <laughs> a mall inside the mall. Where are and you going to find people to work at this mall? A lot of storefront property. Uh, there's, there's, it'll create jobs over here <laughs> in the U.S., you know, Texas, New Mexico, Arizona. Yeah, uh, those are states. Yeah, they'll <laughs> all, inside of this great mall, they'll have the opportunity to, you know, work at a Baskin Robbins. And so you you pretzels. created a you created a uh, a mall wall, yeah. Huh. And uh, you know, I, people are gonna be thirsty down there. And in yeah. Texas, you you gotta have a well. You gotta have a well if you want water in Texas. Well, so you I want could, I could I like you that. want a I mall spur business. You want a wall mall well. Would love a wall mall well. Well, several mall wall wells <laughs> every few yards. Every few yards, several yards. I a know. football field. I, don't know if I, like I would that. say, I would say, separate them by Adele. Adele. Mm. We have a mall wall well separated by Adele. Adele. Uh, Trump. And Trump is a great businessman. I, uh, yeah, I you keep, keep saying that. What has to do with Trump? Perrier. So Perrier, I mean, Perrier. Perrier. list. Because Trump is a good businessman. Is really what I'm hearing here. So Trump, Trump's business acumen. Has decided to you that the French, the, you needed a good American water. No. Yeah. Uh, not from Michigan. Yeah, so why not Michigan? <laughs> but, yeah, uh, we, we've heard the rumors. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's all there. Any, anywhere else. <laughs> anywhere else, just not Michigan. You know they say Ohio's got actually worse water than Michigan, and they, haven't, they haven't, people aren't talking about it. So why is only anyone talking about that? I don't know. The Cleveland's got horrible water. We all have horrible water in the apples. I drink... Personally, I don't want to say I'm an expert because I drink tap water constantly, so... Like, 70% comes from the White River and the Canal. Is that a good river? No. no not at all. 70%? Well, 
Like 70 or 67 percent. That's either how much water we drink <laughs> or how much water is our body. I don't. It's I, either a round number or this one specific number. Yeah. Those are the only two numbers it could be. That's right. That's exactly what it is. And I'm just glad you didn't say 69 percent, which is oh, that's wow. You know what I mean? Because of the sex act. I'm right. The way they people 69 each other. I'm I'm comfortable with that. Yes. I'm Christian. Can we move on? I want to see what uh, <laughs> this uh, lesser guy. Lesser yeah. guy. Lesser man than you? Yeah. I come from a family of well salesmen, and you just are <laughs> making up a degree. I, it, it was in my turn. I, it, it, Take it, it, raw water off the list. Raw I'll water off why. the list. So raw water was somebody put in an article about some really rich people are buying. I read it. I read the article. So could you just, could you explain it to the, the people watching and uh, to me and... Uh, uh, Connery, is it? Raw water is sold to Silicon Valley and similar demographics throughout the nation for two and a half gallons, $36. For two and a half gallons of raw water. It's just not, it's not filtered, it's not distilled, it's just in, it's just taken from the earth like a well and put in bottles and it's so expensively. They're... It, well water is what raw water is, and they just they put it in bottles. It's a it's a bastardization of my so worst you're, fears. So you're upset because it's basically bottleizing your actual business. Actually, the one thing you had separate from bottled water. Right. Mm. So it, you don't, you don't like water? Do you like water treatment plants? No. 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 Just <laughs> let the well do that. <laughs> let the well treat it. It's like a British system for the earth. <laughs> yeah. And it just makes it beautiful, and you just you just bring up the pail, you toss in a wish if you need to wish about something. Yeah. Um, you can get trapped down there. It's bad for big water. It is bad for big water. You know, we're little water. <laughs> little we're, water. We're unionized. I feel like most people don't want just a little water, though. Well, a little water here and there. Yeah, that's fair. It depends. If you have crops, then I can understand you need a lot of water. But oh again, wells lead to great irrigation. But I'll tell you, farmers... Boy, would they not like bottled water. Mm -mm. That's so much work to un like screw the cap each time that feed each like yes, like corn. A, like a bottle every four seeds. Is it a corn plant? Oh, or is it corn stock? Is that what you're asking? Oh yeah, I'm not from Indiana. I'm from the Silicon Valley. No, I buy my water you're raw water. Man. That's fine. That's I'm fine. a raw water man. Yeah. When I was in high school, I used to say raw a lot, like just casually. Like, yeah. That's raw dog. I used to say that. That's how I used to talk. Was it like a symptom of the environment, or did you watch a movie? Well, I mean, I've watched movies, that said raw. <laughs> but that's not why I, I said raw. I mean, I've definitely seen a movie. How does raw school. work into your vocabulary? Raw was a lot. That's, there's a cash talk between my friends. Oh, that's cash raw. Talk. Oh, that's cash. Well, cash is a new thing. We used to say casual right. back in high school. Right. Uh, I shortened it, though. I took the U-L, U-A-L out. Hmm. <laughs> U-L. Who needs them? No, nah, well, you know, other languages. Well, Anyways, well, uh, I'm glad we got that out of the way. I'm up next to take off a bottle of water. And, uh, I'm not going to take it off yet, but I will, uh, I'm going to take off Volvic. Ah, mineral. Uh, because, well, I don't know what mineral water is. I just don't like saying the word vulva. So it sounds like that, and it makes me uncomfortable. Several subliminals. Several. Almost eight. So I don't like Volvic. So Volvic water, to me... She's just taken off the list. If anyone wants to fight me, that's fine. But I've ever, never heard of it until just before I put this list together. Yeah, I, that's one I had to uh, do a brief Google on. <laughs> yeah. And all my oppo research, I didn't get the vulva. Typical whale, whale salesman. Whale? Or whale? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh my salesman. gosh. Typical you can't whale even salesman. speak, let alone. You have to Google different kinds of water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just because it's in your textbooks. What what are, you, what are you studying right now amongst the, your water sommelier class? Just read labels. Uh, Aquafina. Right You're on just Aquafina? Okay. Right. So, uh, my mom so they chapters are separated by the different bottled waters? Yeah. Uh, Not the taste of it, just the actual yes. brand name? Yeah. Uh, and my mom, she drove me to a good hiking spot recently <laughs> where I got some good pictures. Where do you hike? We're in Indiana. Like 30 feet up and 30 feet down. Indiana? We're like... Hiking capital of the world. Yeah, that's actually that's the true thing that was said. Donald Trump said it recently in the as his presidency. So nice. Indiana is the hiking capital of the world. And also, he's I, a good businessman. Yeah. So if you're gonna listen to anyone about hiking, he's the one to listen to. So. I won't listen are to you, you. Are you a good businessman? Um, 
No. no, because this bottle of water is destroying your business. I haven't sold a well in Good. a decade. <laughs> I haven't sold a decade. Well, that's a long time. Thankfully, my grandfather and father made enough money in the well business that I can just live off of you know their earnings. But is there not a lot of females in the well business? No, there's the well business. It's very it's just me. My wife was part of the well business, and then she left me. Oh. Mm. You know what's funny is no one would correct you and say well business. It should be said good business. But no one will ever say that because it sounds That's, like it's a yeah, bad business. Right. Good wells. I saw good wells. Well, good. You never heard of it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't. That's a moment. Uh, step out of my life here. That's a great moment that no one will ever see. <laughs> but perfect. Uh, anyways, improv. Uh, we're gonna keep going here with the youngest person here. The start. We're gonna do another round of veto because that went so well. We're gonna start with the youngest person here, so well. uh, Mr. Connor Re Roberts. Uh, Robert Roberts. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know. I didn't pay attention. <laughs> You're up next. What do you think is not the best bottle of water? You know, Arrowhead isn't even in my textbooks. <laughs> <laughs> so I no. think get get her off the list. Who's she? So, wait, do you consider brands to be a female version of words? Or just Arrowhead? Well, that's what they teach that's you weird. in your textbook. Well, I don't know if it's weird. It's progressive, I think. That's good. The that's gender good. water. The gender water. It's just pretentious. Yeah, what happened to gender fluidity? You know, okay, that's... sorry that, uh... Great. I don't... I'll do it all the time. That's when I'm building my wells, I'm not wondering what... To you, make it fuck other wells. Wait, you build wells? No, I don't. <laughs> you does. couldn't build a well. I've seen him try. Do you he, build he had wells? You an apprenticeship with me. I do. <laughs> so you, now this goes back. You know, you used to work together. Build a well, you dig a well. You were basically. We never worked together. He's me and him were uh, hanging out one night, drinking some wine coolers. <laughs> and he said, I bet you can't build a well, and... The ground I, was very frozen, and I had my doubts. Yeah, I love that movie. Yeah, it's a good one. It's uh, solid. Documentary. Yeah. It's about wells. It's about wells. <laughs> <laughs> Tundra wells. No. Tundra wells. Uh, so yeah, did you build a well? I, uh... You okay? Do you, you need a, a rash? I, I need some you lotion. Cream? I don't have any emotions. Yeah. I literally have none of that. Are you dehydrated? Look, all I'm going to say <laughs> is that I tried to build a well, and when I got a couple feet in, he thought it'd be funny to push me in. Oh, at least it wasn't six feet. And so I left. I even yeah. forgot. You still owe me a six-pack of Mike's Hard Lemonade. Wait, I think you had wine coolers. Huh? We drank it all. <laughs> we drank it all. Mike's Hard Lemonade is the best lemonade that's hard from Mike. By far. Like, not even close. What about no Mike's Hard Light Lemonade? Oh, my You God, can drink right. more and feel less guilty. Yeah, that's fair. I'm fat. You know that? Mm. I'm getting fatter. You know? I've been, I'm a fat I'm a fat boy. Mm. He's not. I've never had to deal with that problem. Well, you don't drink that much water. This is all water weight. It's all oh. water weight. Yeah. A lot of retained water. Yeah, you know, because I trust water. I believe in water, so I retain it. Sorry yeah. that I rely on real things like Gatorade to hydrate me. <laughs> it's got electrolytes. <laughs> Jinx, you owe me a water. I don't. <laughs> oh, are you guys best friends now? Just wait till he asks you to. Better friend than you. Better well. friend than you. <laughs> well, I don't. I'm not going to dig a well, Jeff, if that's who you're wanting this to go to. No one's going to want your well. No one wants wells anymore. So okay, no, okay. It wasn't just my specific wells. No, just it's wells just, in general. Wells I thought that was an insult, but now you realize it's a sad, no one buys sad wells. life that you live. Anyways, uh, we're going to start. Uh, we're going to keep this veto round going. I, folks, I know you watching at home may be as depressed as watching an episode of This Is Us, but this is good, so you're welcome. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Nothing better on a podcast to tell people this is good. This is good. This, this is, is well. well. <laughs> we, we go together like like stuff mm. that goes together well. Mm. Jeff, you're up next. What are you taking off as not the best bottle of water? Um, ooh, this is tough. I'm it doesn't gonna, get easier. I'm going to say uh, Dasani. Dasani, I'm wow. Gonna, I like Dasani. I like the bottle shape. I do too. It's I like the label. It seems very watery. The bottle's usually like a, a, a tint of a darker blue in it. 
It's, I mean, that was kind of my go-to, but I guess you're going to have to take the song. It's, it's got a taste. It's got I've a heard taste. It's, I've heard it's tap water. Aren't they all tap water? No. No. Well, <laughs> well water isn't. Well water's not tap water. Smart water's not tap water. Yeah, well water's just disgusting dirt water. <laughs> it's, <laughs> you're a disgusting dirt boy. Oh, well after you pushed him in, he definitely was. He was right. covered in dirt. I'm going to yeah. take an Uber home. Yeah. Well, you can take him He'll turn his app on. He'll take it home. Yeah. <laughs> there's no one up here to surf. Yeah, there's no one. All downtown. There's no one in this area of where do I live? Uh, uh oh, I burped. There's a road. Um. Hint. Hmm. Anyways, we're gonna keep doing the list. I'm up next. Decide what the next not the best bottle water, and uh, I'm taking this one off simply because it doesn't. When people drink it, it's not commonly known as a bottle. No. I'm God. taking off. No, no. I'm taking off. And also, I don't like the French, like Connor here. I'm taking off LaCroix. Oh. Uh, LaCroix, one, I don't consider it bottled water because it's got these flavors in it. I don't need flavors. I just want simple water because I'm a simple man. And two, it's, a, it's more canned than anything. It comes in cans. People are drinking LaCroix from cans. Can LaCroix, can LaCroix do it? We don't know. Stay tuned. Guess what? No, it didn't do it. It's off the list. I'm taking LaCroix. Oh, it's too far out for me to do it. Uh, this, this is despite me because I took off the sign. Yep, yeah, this is despite Jeff. Jeff who wanted LaCroix to win this whole thing. I did. Which, to be fair, he wanted a non-water to win the water. I don't consider it water. I consider it like Perrier. I'm glad Connor took Perrier off because I don't consider that sparkling water. Fresh. It's the French. And, well, I'm not going to get... My, most of my viewers are French. <laughs> Big French demographic. Well, they love it. Hopefully they'll... Uh... They call me the Jerry Lewis of podcasts. Mm. That's what they... But ask, ask him if he gets that reference. Do you get that reference? Uh, Stupid <laughs> boy. Do you get that reference? No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so... uh, the French love Jerry Lewis. <laughs> well, Anyways. Well, well, they can leave. <laughs> they can leave. You can leave. They can leave or work in the mall. Oh, the mall, in, the, in the wall mall? Yeah. Do they drink with the wall mall well? It's separated by no. Adele? We're not putting any wells there. Oh! Bad for big water. Well, then I'm against the wall. I was only about the wall because I could put wells. Well, I take well, it back. Rewind the tape. Uh, you could just say that the deal, the deal for the mall wall wells just fell through. That was a stretch. Yeah, I didn't like it. But anyways, I did it, and that's what happened. Folks, uh, we are down to our final five bottle waters. This show is just chucking along. We've been going pretty quick. Should we've been, we've learned horns. a lot. Uh, beep, 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 beep. Is that an air horn? Oh, beep. Uh, <laughs> it's like a checkout. Beep. Uh, well, I'll hold it down longer. Beep, 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 beep. That doesn't make any sense. Anyways, I... Uh, um, I ate red rum, red rum, red rum. Oh, I yeah. whoa, oh, murder horn. Wow. I uh, my name is Joe Bates. I'm hosting a podcast right now. Well, well. I uh, we are down to our final five. We've been speeding through. We've learned a lot about Connor and Jeff's mainly their relationship, uh, which is ever growing and ever falling apart. Hopefully, they'll be able to bond and get together in the won't. end here. We won't. We don't know though. We won't. Uh, we don't know that for a fact. Anyways, our final five are Evian, Aquafina, Smart Water, Fiji, and Ice Mountain. Mm. Uh, if you're watching on Facebook or on BitChat, you can call in on BitChat if you want to talk to us. But if you're watching on Facebook, you can also talk to us through comments. Uh, let us know if there's a bottled water brand you think we missed out on. Uh, we, uh, we're down to the final five. We've taken off LaCroix, Perrier, Arrowhead, Volvic, Raw Water, Dasani. So if you think there's one we missed, we have a 12 spot. That's open, a wild card spot. So feel free to comment. Uh, feel free to call in on BitChat if you want. Before we continue, uh, Connor, what is your criteria in determining what the best type of bottle water is? Uh, we've all been in that situation where we've uh, yep. been drinking wine coolers all night with our buddies, trading stories. Next morning... You wake up at 8 a.m. in your underwear, put on your clothes one... I feel like there's a big jump. ...at a time, 
Okay. You put your pant legs on one at a time. It's just saying, yeah. we're wine coolers the way because I'm underwear. I feel like there's just a, there's a time, it's, time jump. He blacks out. Joe, Joe like out? He's very uh, It's Joe. Joe, uh, it's something you can only experience, uh, I, I can't describe it. So you think you're paying like one at a time, yeah. and uh, you go... And then you go to the gas station, and you're hungover from all the wine coolers, so... Yeah, that'll uh, happen, 7-Eleven. Uh, you should like gas stations. We did Best Gas Station Snack uh, two episodes ago. That was our 50th oh, episode. Uh, best Gas Station Snack, Jerky. Ah! Mm. Mm. I was hoping gummy worms would win. I like munchies. Honey mustard Snyder pretzels. Anyway, so you're I'm hoping for sponsors. You're hungover and you're just trying to find the best bottle of water, so <laughs> Honey Mustard Pretzels Wells. Uh, <laughs> this well is brought to you by Honey Mustard, mustard pretzels. pretzels. You thirsty? You will be. <laughs> you <laughs> will be. You will. Oh. God, you're good. Do you have some uh, uh, I write my own Do you have some people you need to drive right now? <laughs> okay. You're, so uh, you go to you, you go to your gas station, leave Jeff out of the guy's growing up. Every day. Uh, trying. <laughs> and you pick out your favorite bottle of water. And uh, Yeah. Well, and that's what we're doing today, but we're not at the gas station. We're yeah. At the I mean, yeah. When you ask him his criteria, I mean, let's... That is my criteria. Oh, and <laughs> what, what looks cool when I'm drinking it while taking a picture. Okay. Feel mm. free. That it was a long way to get something that didn't tie into the original story. <laughs> well... <laughs> Uh, feel free to comment if you think we missed something. Uh, assuming you're not going to if you haven't by now. We do have people watching. Uh, Jeff, what's your criteria in basing what the best bottle of water is? Um, I do you like... have a long story about a night with wine coolers? No, I don't waste people's time. Um, my <laughs> criteria How is... How long does it take to build a well? Uh, surprisingly not very long. Technology's really caught up with the industry. Nice. And you can just, you know... A lot of just, that, just the crank? Yeah, the crank. Just the crank. It's, like, that... I, it's like ice fishing on dirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, alright, so what's your first criteria? Uh, the first one is aesthetic, how it looks. Yeah. Similar to that, but also market share. The less it's sold, the <clears> more <throat> I like it. So you want the less possibly sold water? Yeah, you know, you could call it exclusive. I, exclusivity. Of luxury. Water. You luxury. Want, you want a luxury water. It doesn't have to be luxury, you know, but if it's luxury, I don't mind. But raw water you did not like. Fuck raw raw water. It's, it's not even. It's just. It's just a scam. I say it's lawless. Lawless, not Lucy lawless. Lucy. You know you people are always just. You, well, you, you people. people. You guys are just. Always you guys. For more more more. You are a water sommelier. You are asking for a career which does not exist. The community college no, there is. is some, just taking your somebody money. Somebody did comment about a water sommelier. There are water sommelier out there. That actually is a true career. Oh, well. It's not a good one, and I can imagine it's a lot of fluster and a lot of being fake. Mm. Uh, BuzzFeed. <laughs> which, uh, BuzzFeed, if you're watching, thanks to the uh, for the exposure to um, our profession. Uh, thank you, guys. They'll send you an article that says top ten ways to appreciate thanks. <laughs> I, I, Number seven will totally make you feel appreciated. I, I love the guys at BuzzFeed. Uh, <laughs> what do you mean, guys at yeah. BuzzFeed? For someone who's gendering water, it's pretty good. Well, I feel like it's mostly guys that work there. Um, <laughs> no, I just saw a article written by AK. Wait, wait, what's the last time you read a good article? Uh, what? what? BuzzFeed is listening to this. You don't read. Most of my viewers are French BuzzFeed guys. <laughs> BuzzFeed does not hire French people. Otherwise, <laughs> I, I wouldn't be watching. <laughs> watching. He watching. He watches BuzzFeed. Uh, they have videos. <laughs> Watch one top ten Halloween couples costume. What was your favorite one? You're so alone. Okay. Tell that to his mom. Okay, so, actually, it was one that me and Jeff saw together, and it was Mario <laughs> and Luigi, and I said we should go as Mario and Luigi for Halloween, wouldn't that be fun? And I wanted to be Mario. And he thinks just because he's got reddish hair that he gets claim on Mario. Honestly, I would have thought you'd be Mario, you'd be Luigi. That's what I would have well, thought, Well, you would have thought wrong. Uh, well, no, my reason is, okay, is you're, well, you're skinnier. That's well, right. 
Joe, it's next, a compliment. Next Halloween, you guys can go together. And no, this is nonsense. Luigi, this is what I don't like. I think Luigi should be the main guy in Mario and Luigi. He's Everything he says is bullshit. It's taller, he's skinnier, and everyone likes a short fat guy, which in any other scenario in the world, no one likes a short fat guy. Like, like a tall skinny Luigi guy. Luigi would fit down the tubes Like better. if Ryan Gosling and Zach Galifianakis hung out. Gosling okay, who's getting... taller between me and you? Me. No, between me and Jeff. <laughs> I am Obviously, the tallest. you're the tallest. Well, I don't want to brag. I'm not standing up. I'm not We're not, it's a, we don't have time for stand-ups. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I have improv people. Oh my god, am I just all words today? <laughs> uh, you, you're off the charts. I'm not doing that. Oh, oh that's great. Alright, cool. uh, well we're down to our final five. We're going to go one at a time. No one commented or called in because you guys are really ruining this episode for me. Now I'm just joking, oh. they never do. Uh, Evian Water. Do you think Evian Water is a top three water? If you don't know, I want to put in the bubble. <laughs> the bubble. Uh, we can. But right now, do you think Evian water is a top three bottle of water? I'm going to say yes. You're Just for the name. Yeah, the name is... The commenter. <laughs> the name is pretty good. What do, you, what do you think? No. No. What is your reasoning? Uh, just, I've tried Evian water. Uh, it doesn't look great. It looks like uh, mom gets it to when she's going to the YMCA to work out. Oh, you think it's like a mom water? Yeah, it's a mom water. He thinks it's French, that's why he doesn't like it. Do you think it's French? I know it's French. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how do you like, do you like the Alps? Um, anyways, I, uh, Evian water backwards is naive. Naive. Which is pretty funny. Blew my mind. It blew my, you know, it, it also, my mind was also blown. Hmm. Did you know that? My mind wasn't. That You're was the mom. first thing I noticed when. I, <laughs> I you know, I'll get to be honest. Before this episode started, I really thought Jeff would be the villain, <laughs> but Connor is really owned up. I'm a nice I, person. I think he I'm an is honest businessman, <laughs> and you're a pretentious, made-up man. So naive Evian is a <laughs> pretentious, made-up man. Uh, Evian naive backwards. Uh, but you're saying top three just because of the name, not because of the water. You're saying not a top three. Again, sticking with the French thing. So we're going to put it on the bubble, keep going on, and let's see if it's better than other waters. Next up, Aquafina, which I think is a standard bearer in water. Uh, but it, it, I think it's probably the most sold water. Yes. I would uh, agree. Uh, My market Ice share Mountain research. might. Ice Mountain might be. Ice Mountain? Yeah. We're not. I know, but not. That's Aquafina. You, you're talking out of your ass right now, like you always. <laughs> I'm not. Ice Mountain, they just have the big ones now, like those big, yeah, gallon ones. I wish I do like. Oh, uh, like. what am I drinking then at work? I think I'm drinking Ice Mountain. I'm drinking like bottled Ice Mountain. They have yeah. regular. I think bottles. Ice Mountain got a lot of the corporate deals. So like you're that. asking the guy who doesn't buy bottled water, ever. I'm not asking. Well, I guess I, I am asking him, but he, he is a special guest expert. He's studying water. He, he goes out. He walks into his acres, uh, like three, four acres. Oh, own a lot of land. That's and, nice. A lot of room for wells. Every morning, I actually respect someone who owns a he, lot of land. Uh, pulls the bucket up like yep. some hillbilly and walks. Oh, okay. Oh, right. Right. Oh, okay. Jeez, like some hillbilly. Like some hillbilly. That's some stank on that name. You know, like try that again. I know a lot of some hillbilly. Oh, oh that's that worse. This is even meaner. Mm. It, it, there wasn't even a follow-up sentence to it. We were just saying that word meaner. You are a sad, strange little man. <laughs> yeah. So, where are we saying? Are you saying Aquafina is the top three bottle of water? Uh. There's only three after this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'd say so. And you're you saying I'll go be in the top yeah, three? Yeah, so that kind of goes it. against what you said, though, where you don't like a better selling. You want a low market share. Rockafina is the best selling water. Right. Uh, they have strong armed me a lot. We've had some <laughs> head a lot, and I've, I've I've got a lot of respect for them. Yeah, they they. I mean, they don't fuck around. They're like the Monsanto for water. I have been put in that place. <laughs> uh, all right, we're gonna continue on the smart water. Is smart water a top three water? Jessica Anista or Jennifer? Oh fuck, I messed up her name. Yeah, so she's never gonna watch this show again. I wanted to. I wanted to say she has my. <laughs> Maybe you should too. get something other than a Honda Element our, for her to notice you. Our biggest, our biggest fans are actually French Buzzfeed writers who love Jennifer Aniston. So I know. we really, have, I've lost 
all my fans this episode. But look, I am loyal to Smart Water. <laughs> I'll I take even, that, Aquafina. I even brought one. <laughs> so he's drinking Smart Water unopened. Uh, I, I, not any water has been drank out of that. I bought this eight years ago. <laughs> Smart Water does do the longer bottle. They love that. They're right. a sleek bottle. Yeah. It's a sleek bottle for a sleek man. I throw darts at it. I, I keep missing. You throw darts at it. I keep missing. That's why it's still Do you like Smart Water or do you throw darts at it? I have a love-hate relationship. Yeah, with that things. makes sense. Based on everything you've built up in this entire episode, it sounds like you have a love-hate for bottled water. Yeah, everything's two sides at the same coin. Yeah. Well. It's me flipping a coin, huh? He's a real Gemini. Twins! And you're a... Right? Hmm? Are Gemini's yeah. the twins? It's it's split personalities. One time you'll be talking to oh. him and another One time, time you'll be building a well together and another time you're yeah. in the well. Yeah. Yeah, he's also taking astrology classes. In you know what? Do you, what do you think? Well, he is a, you know, this is... A, I don't want to go on a t- too much of a tangent, but baby Jessica. Hmm? The, the baby that was lost in the well that they had to find to get out of the well. Yeah, that hurt. That, How, that couldn't have been good for you, the well business. No, it was actually, a, it's, yeah, it's, the decline of the well industry has been a series of falls. <laughs> yeah. And <laughs> bottle salesmen kind of rallied around the tragedies. And you can't you can't get lost in a bottle of water. Yeah. It, 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 like, it was a lot of, very disrespectful to the families, the way the water bottle industry would just kind of, like, pawn that off. And you should see the commercials. It's like a political action committee. Yeah, as a well. Can you, can you go through one of the commercials for us? Yeah, it goes, like, well. And, <laughs> and they talk about how there's no nets and just people fall in. And yeah. they don't talk about how you can wish in a well and how you how you, you get arm strength by cranking it up. Like you don't have to work out if you pull up three bales of water. The actual make a wish industry has really dropped off. They since took the- off. They took my thing. <laughs> wells make wishes, but none of them ask for wells. Well, you can't get a kid in the hospital to a I well. Know, I know. Once you build a well, you even gotta bring the well into the hospital. And they were not gonna do that. They weren't happy. They said they had bubblers. I mean, what is this? <laughs> yeah, bubblers. Well, uh, I uh, didn't even mean to say it that time, but it's just fun to say. Mm-hmm. Uh, you gotta be honest. Uh, after this episode, you may want to look into being maybe a full time podcast guest for someone else's podcast. I'm just gonna take the. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna take wells everywhere. I'm gonna. I'm gonna bring wells back. Well. Okay. <laughs> God damn it, I feel bad saying it every time. Now I start all my sentences with that word. You should you should patent the word. He does this to you. I'm trying he to. He tries it's... to get in your head and... I'm in your head. That's why you know I'm there. Wait, are, is he a figment of your imagination? No, I see him. No, that doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense. Unless you're a figment of my... It, no, I'm not getting into this. Is this whole thing... I've, I've been here before. You're real, Joe. You're a real boy. Do you guys ever wonder if we're, like, a speck on someone else's finger? No. I wonder if we're a drop in a big, giant bottle of water. Mm. That sounds unplausible. I think we're a penny <laughs> in Unplausible? Yeah. Unplausible. Uh, okay, so smart it's water, is it top three water? Uh, no. Yes. Really? You don't think smart water's in the top three? No, I don't. So to you, you think an Aquafina and these other two, do you think Fiji is the top three water? No. That's 100%. Really? Yeah. No. I like Fiji myself. So it looks like, it looks like what I'm hearing though, well let's go next, is Ice Mountain top three water. Yes. No. So what are your top three waters? Aquafina, and Smart Water, and Fiji. No, I mean, and, uh, fine, Ice Mountain. I don't want Fiji. Wait, we're... I know I don't want Fiji. I just Fiji, know I don't want Fiji. Fiji is officially gone, that's what we're saying. We're saying that Fiji is official. Have you ever held a Fiji? I've held Wait, a Fiji. Wait, do you like Fiji? I, I love Fiji. Fiji. Wait, I think you said Fiji's not a top three No, water. I said it is a top three You're water. saying it is a top. Yeah. I like Fiji because it's a different bottle shape. It's square. Yeah. But I side with the people of Fiji. The people of Fiji aren't getting a cut of the water bottle industry. Oh, I didn't know They're that. Just pawning off the name, making it sound exotic. Well... Otherworldly. So you you are you're know, fine with screwing over what? you know the second world nation. Japanese people have been screwing over America for years. All right, let's leave them out of this. <laughs> well, this Fiji is not part of Japan. It, it, you're just racist. It's a part of somewhere. No, wait, 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 Connor. Let's stop for a second. Do you think Fiji and Japan are the same thing? Yeah. Oh, well, that's 
I'm not surprised that he thinks. Do you know Fiji is a small island nation in the Pacific Ocean? That's a part of... Uh, geography is not important here. <laughs> I think it is for this no, one no. moment. No. Now you see. Now you see. <laughs> uh, it, it's not important whatsoever, but... The point is, other people have been screwing us out of jobs. They've been taking our jobs. America's going to be great again. And uh, So you don't like the foreign aspect of it? I love the foreign aspect of it. You're all over the place. <laughs> I can't even keep up with you. I don't know. And usually it's not very difficult. You hate the French. You like the Fijians. You think Japanese people are taking your jobs. You think Japan and Fiji are the same place. I don't know where you stand on Fiji. To be, you say you love it, but everything you say, all the other things, all these other fingers on my hand say that you don't like it. Well, Joe, if you let me finish. I'm trying to. Uh, you don't know how you're going to finish. This. Land this plane. It's, Land. A very, it's a very pretty bottle that... Uh, Hudson uh, River is right in front of you. It really surpasses human uh, interaction and... Uh, the problems we have with each other. That's what, that pink, that's what that pink flower represents on it. Which is why I love Fiji water. So you think we shouldn't build a wall? I think we should. Still <laughs> build the wall. Just covered in flowers. Yeah. How about pe people being together? Yeah. <laughs> Representing people together as they exactly. build a giant wall. Yes. Okay, well I'm starting to understand a little bit more. You're saying Fiji shouldn't be on the list. I'm saying Fiji shouldn't be on the list after everything that just happened in this conversation. Yeah, that's good. That's so we're problem. taking Fiji off, and I think I think we should also take Evian off. I agree as well. That's what I'm okay with. You're now on Evian. We're gonna take Fiji right. off. We're gonna leave it to Aquafina, Ice Mountain, and Smart Water, that's which funny. I think is a pretty good top three. Yeah. Uh, I I mean I thought Fiji had a chance of winning this whole thing, but then you talked. Connor, you talk. It's important. It ruins a lot of things. <laughs> Him opening his mouth. Uh, all right, we're down to our final three, folks. Aquafina, Smart Water, and Ice Mountain. Uh, just quick, real quick, any like any memories for any of these specific waters that you personally have? I know you have a bottle of Smart Water for eight years that you haven't opened. You just like looking at it and you throw darts at it. Uh, I don't know how your relationship with your parents is going. Uh, not great. Well, you Dad's had, disappointed. Yeah, you, yeah you've I, been kind of the worst. Ran his business into the ground. <laughs> That's, That's a good one. Wanted, you know? I wish you were watching, you guys. You, I hear you laughing. That was a good one. Uh, ran his business because it's a well. You see what I'm saying, Connor? Into the uh, ground. I think Connor. I get it. It's a wall. You think this you is it? all he does. He makes well puns all day. Is that true? Yeah. That's good. I like that. How many stars would you give him in an Uber? Wow, well, that's just a whole different well me drive. It's a Hyundai element, and to me, the um, only two yeah. elements I care about are hydrogen and oxygen. Oh, yeah. periodic. I get it. Well, no, all the time, not just periodically. Uh, gosh. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's two hydrogens and one oxygen. Yeah. They make uh, coffee. H2O. And coffee. Mm. That's a beautiful thing about water is that... They, <laughs> you don't drink it that much. They, they teach you in Somalia school that, uh, <laughs> that it's that okay much. to have Kool-Aid mix and stuff to your water because that's Man, the, one this, of the beauties of this water. This Somalia school makes no sense because... It's not Somalia school. It's community college. <laughs> He's the only student in an online course. I would think water, I think water Somalia would monitor the purity of water, but you're adding flavors. That's the beauty of water. <laughs> Hot chocolate mix. Uh, instant coffee. Instant coffee, anything. You're ruining water. So you, you love the purity of water because you don't want a bottle. You want it to go straight from the earth. There's nothing better than water from the earth. I would say there's nothing better than just being in a loving relationship. I don't know anything about Guys, that. anyways, we're up to our final three. Any of these between Smart Water, Aquafina, Ice Mountain stand out as something that shouldn't be in the top two to you? Ice Mountain. Because I think, like, Connor likes that one. I'll say Smart Water. <laughs> this, well, I'll say Aquafina. No, uh, Jesus Christ, you're, getting, you're making me have to decide between Smart Water 
and Ice Mountain. You drink Ice Mountain at work, don't you? All the time. There are better mountains. Space Mountain. But, I'll say this, if I'm at a gas station, I'm not selecting a Ice Mountain. That's right. I'm what more likely selecting? to select the Fiji, Fiji? Yeah. a Smart Water. Yeah. Uh, actually, I usually, I've been choosing the Smart Water a lot lately. Yeah. So I drink Ice Mountain a lot, but when I have the choice, I probably choose Smart Water or an Aquafina, because it's a standard bear. I don't usually get the Sani. I just like the way the bottle looks. I'm glad we took the Sani off the list. It really is pure just... Yeah, you know, it's only good at visual. the movie theater because it's the only thing they offer. Yeah, I don't, would never get bottled water at a movie a theater. What, why, why would I not be getting the biggest Mr. Pib cherry that I could possibly get? Large popcorn, lots of butter, diet coke. Oh my gosh, I love popcorn. You like popcorn, Connor? No, I don't. It of makes course. me... It Jesus makes an Christ! <laughs> first. It makes me want water. And I, <laughs> Wait, I don't understand anymore! It doesn't make any sense. I'm not a fan of water, so... He's a stupid, stupid conundrum. <laughs> it's not worth your time. They should call you Connor Drictions. I don't like that. Okay. I like it. Connor Diction. Con- you know what I'm saying? Because of contradictions? That word? And then I put your name in the front? You know what I'm saying? Guys, I said before we started this that I didn't want to make puns about my name. <laughs> okay. Hey. On this panel. Sorry like, for Robertson you of that moment. <laughs> hey, we're the pros, you're the con. <laughs> <laughs> Just wait till you go to a Pizza Hut with him, Joe. Oh, don't talk about Pizza Hut. <laughs> okay, we're going to move on. We'll have the Pizza Hut story for another time. So I am choosing to take off because it reminds me of work, Ice Mountain, off the list. That's a win. For us, a loss for him. I'm happy. So we're down to our final two. Aquafina or Smart Water. Uh, man, this is tough. I am going... Man, I don't know. I'm going to ask Connor to vote. What do you think is the best bottle of water? Aquafina or Smart Water? Aquafina, American Made. American Made, Aquafina. Jeff, what do you think is the best bottle of water? Smart water. You are holding a bottle of smart water in your hand. When you look on the inside of the label, there's a little goldfish. And it says, Distill my heart. And you guys know I like puns. That's true. And it's like a, like a, a little dove candy or a Snapple bottle. It adds to your life. No, you can't. You can see it. <laughs> you, you can't can hold it. it. I, uh... I, so usually what happens in this podcast we get to the final two is I let one special guest expert vote. Then I usually just vote opposite and let the other one make the tiebreaker. This is one of those rare scenarios that I could see they weren't going to agree. No. <laughs> it's, an, it's been an hour-long build-up to a disagreement consistently throughout this. So it's up to me to decide between Aquafina and Smart Water. You already said to still my heart. You just talked about the label. Why is Aquafina better than uh, Smart Water? American Made. Just American made. Trump businessman. Uh, two episodes of the worst Trump controversy. Mm-hmm. He didn't have, you'd be surprised. He had a few. Did uh, Big Water come up at all? No, no Big sure. Water. Uh, none of that Big Water problems. So I am here to decide between Aquafina and Smart Water. I like both. You know, we're the best bottle of water. The top two are both going to be good. Mm. I probably would have picked Ice Mountain. But I just chose to pick it off the list. So even I, you're very generous. Sitting folks. next to Connor, am a man of contradictions. Mm. You, you you really rubbed off on me. That's good. Not I'm just sexually that. before the show. You should take a shower afterwards. Get that off of you. Oh, well, what is a shower but not just a bunch of bottled water coming at you from the earth? From the <laughs> from the earth. Uh, Aquafina, smart water, Aquafina. Smart water, Aquafina, that is Spanish. Actually, I think it's French. Uh, no. <laughs> Fina. It's Fina. It's Fina. Fina. What is it? So, Aquafina stands for fine water. Yeah. <laughs> sure, you can say that. Fine water, smart water. Fine water, smart water. Finkelstein. Uh, smart water. Smart water. I... Man, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go, right, folks. I am voting. Best bottle water is smart water. Whoa! Everybody. Whoa! Smart Whoa. water wins. Whoa. 
because it really got me how dumb I feel that I feel like I drink it, I actually get smarter. Uh, is there something in smart water other than water? Electrolytes and vape, and it's vapor distilled in vape? water. It's, it's, it's vape. electrolytes it's and a vape. It's a vape water. It's a vape water, folks. You can do tricks with it. Smart water is the best water. Uh, that happened. Connor loves it. Uh... <laughs> I wanted to say thank you so much, everyone, for watching this episode of Best Bottle Water. I also like to thank my guest uh, experts, Jeff Stanich, a uh, very funny uh, improv dude within and uh, sketch guy within the city of Indianapolis. Do you have a Twitter uh, or a, a website or something you like to plug? I don't got a Twitter. I would like to plug uh, uh, Off Topic Indie. It's uh, at Off Topic Indie. It's a group I'm a part of. We've got a show tonight, our debut at the White Rabbit Cabaret. Okay. Most people don't watch live, but if, they watch in, uh, if they're watching on YouTube, you should definitely uh, check it out. Uh, Off Topic Indianapolis Improv. You can go like their Facebook page. Uh, and, uh, and the other, you know, you figure out some other parts of your life. Connor Roberts, also a, another uh, sketch improv guy in the city, wants to start dabbling in stand-up. I don't know if he's ready, though. He's not. I think that means he is. Connor, uh, do you have any Twitter or anything like the plug so people can reach uh, you or find out what you're doing? Um, there's something I want to plug, just, uh, I need a small loan of $800, uh, my rent is due this week, and so if anyone wants to give that to me, I spend a lot of money on bottled water recently, so uh, thanks. So you can pay about him $800 if you want to. We'll do, we'll do a GoFundMe for him to pay his rent, and then uh, we're not going to do that, actually. No. no not we, worth it. I make no money off this. Show, no one's going to give you money. I have a house. Can I stay with you? No. <laughs> okay, I'm your host Joe Bates, folks. You can follow me on Twitter at Joe America 22. But more importantly, what I'd love for you to do is like the Rank You Very Much Facebook page, where you can actually watch it live every Saturday at 1 p.m. Or actually, more of an and and subscribe to the YouTube channel. We've got a bunch of episodes up there. You can watch all the previous episodes, uh, different things we've ranked in the past. We've done 52 episodes. Not all are on there because some are lost because BitChat is a shitty shitty streaming service that I'm trying to stop doing. I'm wanting to move on to YouTube Live, but I haven't figured out how to do that yet. Uh, probably should figure out during the week, but I usually try to figure out 30 minutes before the show starts, and then it never works. Mm. So, uh, but Facebook Live, uh, every 1 p.m. on Saturday, and uh, you can also watch all the old episodes on YouTube, or on the Facebook page as well. They're all there. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Best bottled water, smart water, uh, is the winner. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Connor. That's Thank you very much. I got to pee. You're welcome.